Hi, this is Ron Mitchell. We're playing the Hunter Call of the Wild on the PC, and today we're doing missions on the Hunger Savannah. We're after Gustav Barden. He's not here. I don't know where he's gone. We've got to find him. Apparently, he's had some mushrooms, had a drink, and he's wandered off somewhere. He's better be alive. His ancestors. This is a tragedy. I, I am gutted. Rambolo wasn't just an animal. She was like family to everyone on this reserve. Now she's gone. I nursed her back to health as best I could, but she was in no condition to make a trip hundreds of kilometers away. So she stayed. Now this, this is what's become of her. I will send a team to clean her up before the jackals come. She's been with us so long, her hide should be preserved. <sighs> okay. I can grieve later. We have work to do. What a storyline. I can't believe it's a rhino. What would you bet those friendly lookers who stole Barden's gear were the criminals who did this? We must find out where they went. Not so you can confront them. You observe and report to me. I report to the police. The police put a team together and round them up. Got it? Now to find them. Poachers are sloppy butchers. Look for things they'll leave behind, like tire tracks. So, I guess we've got to try and find the poachers that killed Rambolo. What a storyline about a rhino. Didn't know anything about that. Great addition. Homo sapiens. So I guess we've got to track these poachers. Follow the footsteps. They might lead us to them. I don't know how this is going to play out. Interesting though. I guess that's why you don't get some of the animals that people ask for. But they can still include them in missions and storylines. Good. Follow those tire tracks. Observe and report. So the footprints have led us to his camp. Be on guard. Oh, get here. Maybe this is their camp. Completed that mission. What's in these buckets? I think I know what they're for. <laughs> Don't stay here too long. They're a group, so you'll probably hear them coming. I think we've got to find details or anything, evidence to what they're up to or where they've gone. Looking around to see if there is anything. Can't see much. Looks like we've deserted the uh, area. Is a smashed up car? So basically, he's saying uh, they would not leave like this. So someone's gone off. Someone sabotaged them. Gustav might have done it. The person we've been trying to find. I don't know where he's gone. If he's joined them or he's just ventured somewhere else, or if he's tried to stop them and maybe been shot. I guess we'll see soon. He's just saying there's more traps in the area, so we've got to go around, try and find them. In the previous trap mission, at the start, on the Hunger Savannah, there was three, so we found one here. They're like a hoop, One less uh, animal a wire, for the poachers. A trap. But I'd never leave just one, one trap. I don't know how many there'll be. There was Keep three scouting. on the previous one. Is it one more? Is it two more? We'll just take a quick look round. This area should be clean then. And we've got to try and find the poachers and Baden. Where's he gone? Where has he gone? He said he had some mushrooms or something to drink and got off wondering after some or looking for something. Where's his trap? Are we looking for his trap? How have you been? How are you all doing? Are you having fun in the game? Are you been bagging any lions? I've seen some albino ones on social media across Twitter and Facebook. Um, so congratulations to people who had them. I've not spotted one myself yet. I've been looking though. Uh, I would like to get a rare lion. What other animals you had? Any diamonds? Any rares? Drop them in the comments. I'd like to hear. Have you been playing classic? Have you been doing the, uh, the Valentine's missions? I've done them. If you want to know how to get uh, some of those trophies really quickly, 
forward emissions, Good right work. line, straight down the right edge. What is that? Fault spawn. Very easy. So have fun with that. Hope you had a happy Valentine's Day. And what I've got to do now? I've got the final trap. Those shots were not meant for you, but they weren't far off either. There's a hut nearby. You should try to take shelter there. But be careful. I have no desire to bury my grandchild today. We just heard some shots there, so I don't know what that is. Might be the people, the poachers fighting. We're going to go check it out. There's a hut apparently, so we'll jump on the quad bike, drive up there, try and have a look at what's going on. But we might find Baden, we might find the poachers. We'll soon see. It's not far, it's just up the road. Let's look at the map. We're right down the bottom there. Got most of the map unlocked. Storylines are great, so a lot of people will play this for the hunting, but don't neglect the storyline. A lot of fun to be had discovering things and learning the lore of the reserves. There's lots of smoke in the background. What's that? made it. I'm curious what that fire is or smoke is. Something's gone off down there. Let me check this hot out. What happened here? With that many shells? That much damage? These maniacs must have been firing in every direction from inside here. But at what? Are they drunk? Or maybe they're being hunted by the Elok. Another thing we'll have to investigate. Get moving. It looks like there's been a big We've fire got fight. reports of smoke coming from the fever tree forest to your west. None of my rangers are out there burning fires right now. Go check it out. Just checking to see if there's any secrets. Sometimes in these rooms there's little things hidden. Right, gotta go to the smoke, the fire. So there's been a big firefight, something's definitely gone off. Can we go down here? A bit steep. <laughs> no, we can't. A wrong card, anyway, he's off. Let's get back on this. So it looks like there's been a big firefight, something's gone off. He mentioned about the Aloko, I'm not sure what that is. If that's a supernatural thing or belief. I guess we might find out in a minute and explain it. People flow around. More shots fired. And they're screaming. Your brother thinks they might be getting trampled by buffalo. But we'd hear the rumble of hooves if that were the case. My gut tells me those poachers are being punished by the Eloko. Your heart is pure, grandchild, but tread lightly, or the Eloko might come for you too. The mm. Eloko? Put that fire out before it causes a problem. Is that some kind of Bahunga Savannah spirit, maybe, that protects it? I'm not sure. Maybe for poaching the rhino, punishing the poachers. Thank you. What else do you see? Signs of poachers? Looks like some scattered belongings, a gun. I'll pick these up. It's quite nice actually. Collect these uh, Their signs. weapons were completely dismantled. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like they've Any been stripped. Any other clues out there? Eaten maybe? I'd hate to be barefoot out there, wouldn't you? Keep Bits looking for signs of life. Or death. Definitely something's gone off. Must be a predator. 
when they all get took out they don't know what's going off <laughs> clothes savage yeah torn clothes torn bodies I think we've seen enough to call this an eloco problem. But your brother still thinks a mad buffalo or a whole head may have been charging the poachers. We can look into that later. I think he may have been at the mushrooms of the drink. <laughs> For now you should rest. There's a shelter nearby. Go take a break there. But keep your eyes and ears open for trouble. So we continue our journey looking for Baden. Maybe spot the Iloko or find out more about that. Let's see. Bit of shelter. No, get back. I don't know if you noticed this just recently, but these damn things are brutal. Like Terminators. Oh my, he's not gone. Die. <gasps> oh, they're so brutal, man. There's another one in there. Oh my, I'm reloading. <gasps> it's over. <laughs> Absolutely brutal at the minute. They're like T1000s. Once they start coming, they don't stop. So make sure you drop them or you're dead. Uh, it's, it's fun though, you've got to admit. In, in multiplayer, especially, you'll be crying with laughter sometimes when they, they're after you. <laughs> right. So we spawn back in. It's the only problem with a big power gun like the 338. If you don't drop them, you've got to take that time to reload because of the one shot and stuff. And yeah. If you don't do it quick enough, you're over. And they take knocking down as well, so you've got to be accurate and make sure you don't hit. I didn't know they were coming. Just about there. Time for you to refresh. Should be safe to go inside. I don't know if you can hear that rumbling, but that is a stampede of wildebeest somewhere around this area. It sounds like thunder. It's great when you see them on the open savannah. What are those pictures of? A ghost jackal. No, not again. Your brother thinks Gustav found his fungi and it inspired these drawings. But I think we are dealing with something well beyond fungi. A restless spirit who does not want Gustav Baden to journey further along. What the heck? Has someone slipped me something? What's going off? I can hear his bells ringing. Ghost Jackal? What's that? Grandchild, are you awake yet? Hello? Hello? Ah, <laughs> there you are. Hope you had a good dream. Now, it's time to get back to work. The other wardens could not find Gustav Baden, but since he decorated that shelter, maybe he is close to you. Can you check on him? So it looks like I've been drawing this ghost jackal he's talking about. Drawings on the wall. Got to find some more things, wherever that is. Uh, it's intriguing about the ghost jackal. I don't know, like he said, whether he's been uh, eating too many of the uh, mushrooms. He's seeing things. That's what he's thinking. But is it real? I don't know. Interesting. Where is the thing we've got to find? We've got to find somewhere. We've just found that. Nah, it's not here. I thought it might be one of these pictures. They're quite well drawn. I like the pictures. So we've done them, well done. Nothing under the bed. I can't see anything. Where are we? I'll search around the hut for clues. So is it in that box? Can't get to the box. So nothing there. 
So I can't see anything in here. It's outside, it's not in there. P bucket. Just check we've not missed anything here. Where is it? There must be some here. I've checked. <laughs> There's not much you can uh, miss in here. Not on the roof. Go outside. <laughs> Ish. Barden left a note while you were sleeping. So he is nearby. And at least he's still alive. Read the note. Mampara. Your brother may not believe in the Eloko or Ghost Jackal, but I hope you have an open mind, because I tell you this, that Ghost Jackal is real, and she means to harm Gustav Baden. <sighs> and even if you are like your brother and you don't believe me, consider that Baden is tracking a jackal with a strange coat which may mean it's malnourished or diseased. Whatever you believe, as wardens, we have a responsibility to find Baden before he has a close encounter of the worst kind. The Eloko is a ghost jack, and I can hear something near me. I hope it's not one of those. Because it sounds like that's what done the process. From here, head north into Vapaladiamba, the Western Reserve. You'll remember it for the big plateau, the one with a view to die for. That's no, you find not the okay, that Buffalo, go away. There are plenty of places along the river to check for signs. The first spot is marked on your map. Let's get in the house. Surely they can't come in the house. <laughs> they are deadly. I know we've got to go there, but I'm not getting on that ATV until uh, we've either down them or they've run off. I think they're going away. The other one, the way it looked at me through the scope, it's like, what are you doing in my area? <laughs> Big bruiser. Well, we've got to go that way. 1.47 kilometers. I think we saved to get on the ATV. And we'll go. Let's get on with the mission. They keep wiping me out. These Cape Buffalo, they are deadly. There's a big stampede somewhere as well, so we've got to watch out for that, because uh, they'll wipe me out. <laughs> It'd be nice to film them, though, if we uh, see it happening. I have got some stampede footage in other videos, so check them out. My Africa videos for the hunger savannah. There's the next location. The area ahead, you might remember, is popular with the tourists. Stop and check it out. We travelled a good way. Right on the edge of a cliff. It looks a bit dodgy. Remember More law. the giant's kettles? We just call them the potholes. When I was a young warden, my friend Mbali and I used to patrol out here. We saw some tourists bring coins and toss them into the holes for good luck. So we started doing the same. We can't do that anymore. It draws too many thieves. The only predators we ever saw here were a family of jackals, always sulking about. They never bothered Mbali and I. At least. You know what? You should keep moving, looking for Baden. There's another spot to the north. Give it a look. So these are like the African wishing wells, apparently. They used to toss coins in here. But he said there's too many fibs, I believe. Let's <laughs> gotta find Baden. Still not find him yet. Has he been eaten by the jackals? Is he with them? Great child, this is not easy for me to talk about, but I must tell you. One day, we were a man down, so Mbali went out scouting on her own, even though she was not feeling well. Nine hours later, she hadn't returned. I knew where to look for her, her lucky potholes. But when I found her, was dead. And the jackals were eating her. Now those jackals have the taste of people, and you know what that means. Two females, their litters, their mate. I had to shoot them all. 
Well, that plot took it a serious never twist. bothered us. But here, I thought these jackals killed Imbali. I was so angry. After I shot them, I didn't harvest them. I didn't honor them. I kicked their bodies into the holes and left them to rot while I brought Mbali back to her family. Maybe that's why there's ghost jackals. <sighs> the jackals, come to find out, did not kill Mbali. Sleeping sickness did. As gruesome as it was, the jackals were scavenging, not murdering. They had to be put down, but with respect, not hatred. This, this is the place where I shot the females. I didn't regret doing it, not at first. But then, whenever I was on night patrol, I began to see it. The ghost jackal. Your brother thinks I should be in therapy for trauma, but the Sangoma confirmed the spiritual nature of the problem. The jackal's spirit haunts me, haunts Bohonga. Now it haunts Gustav Baden. What if, what if it haunts you, grandchild? What if I have cursed our family? Give me a moment here. Your brother is going to lecture me on my superstitious ways. You should continue looking for Baden at the outpost marked up ahead. So what a storyline. Who'd have imagined that? You wouldn't have known unless you do the storyline. What's going off on the reserve and how deep the story goes. Can't believe that. So basically he thought the jackals had killed Mbali. He shot them dead, but it wasn't. It was an illness. So out of respect, uh, he hasn't paid that to the animals. So he's thinking they're roaming around the ghosts because he wasn't killed properly. Such a deep hey, story, man. Thanks for listening to your grandfather without judging him. You're almost at the outpost. Also, I, um, I have some news. The coroner recovered those poachers' bodies, or what's left of them. You made it. Any signs of Baden? So no signs of no. Baden. We're going to continue oh, looking for him in the next video, which will continue on from this. There's a face in the mountain up there. We're going to take a look at that as well. I'm Ron McTube. We've been playing the Hunter Call of Wild, doing the main missions on the Hunger Savannah. Please subscribe to my YouTube channels. Hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.